Hello, and today I'm going to be doing Increase Your Financial IQ by Robert Kiyosaki. Chapter 2 The Five Financial IQs. There are five basic financial IQs. They are Financial IQ 1, Making More Money. Financial IQ 2, Protecting Your Money. Financial IQ 3, Budgeting Your Money. Financial IQ 4, Leveraging Your Money. Financial IQ 5, Improving Your Financial Information. Financial Intelligence versus Financial IQ Most of us know that a person with a mental IQ of 130 is supposedly smarter than a person with an IQ of one of 95. The same parallels can be drawn with Financial IQ. You can be the equivalent of a genius when it comes to academic intelligence, but the equivalent of a moron when it comes to financial intelligence. Often I am asked, what is the difference between financial intelligence and financial IQ? My reply is, financial intelligence is that part of our mental intelligence we use to solve our financial problems. Financial IQ is the measurement of that intelligence. It is how we quantity, quantify our financial intelligence. For example, if I earn $100,000 and pay 20% in taxes, I have a higher financial IQ than someone who earns $100,000 and pays 50% in taxes. In this example, the person who earned the net 80,000 after taxes has a fi higher financial IQ than the person who earned the net $50,000 $50, after taxes. Both have financial intelligence. The one who keeps more money has a higher financial IQ. So basically like the difference between financial IQ and financial intelligence intelligence is like financial intelligence is like part of our brain we use to solve financial problems and then financial iq is like h how we measure that intelligence okay i hope you like that if you should please like and subscribe bye